there's people in there. Yeah. This is Courtney. There's amazing hats. We can see it from here. And we are Vintage Reds. Yes. Oh my goodness. <gasps> Stop the what? What is this? Cut off the sleeves and make it a little sexier. That is not okay. No? <laughs> really? I like it. This hide like the whole stuffed animal. Those are drag queen size. Truck, summer. That's super cute. We have a truck full of awesome vintage finds, repurposed finds, and we are traveling across the country. We're almost there! <gasps> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> it's stocked with really awesome vintage items that we have been selling in Brooklyn. <laughs> selling, sharing, acquiring. We're also acquiring because we need to acquire new stuff to sell in the new places we go to to get to the next place. Like 44, <laughs> that's still over budget. Yeah, it's gonna be our gas money and our, yeah. our travel and our food. So one of our goals is to sort of share our love of vintage with other people. I think it also opens people's minds up to maybe an alternative way of dressing. We're in a time in fashion now where you can sort of get away with dressing a little bit more eccentric. Turn down the holla. <laughs> where Candy and I have always been weird, now there's like other people in the world that are embracing their weirdness too. Candy, oh my god. <laughs> Nobody saw it. <laughs> I'm all about not buying things that I see other people wearing. And if it costs only $5, even better. She's amazing when we go into a thrift store. Courtney knows exactly where to go, what to do. I think the store is really good for dresses. This is like a really fancy Italian leather. That is a fashion don't. I love her to death. However, sometimes she has a little ADD. She has a hard time focusing. <laughs> she likes to shop for she herself, which too. is ultimately not hard. going to make us any money. Here. I like this. This is cute. No. Okay. <gasps> Seriously? Where'd she go? Candy. Seriously? Come on. Chris. Look. I found a bunch of sweaters, old Look. sweaters. Five dollars. Come on. Stay on track. All right. This kind of goes with my outfit right now. Like if I'm like Annie Ugly. Hold on. Let me get you some dinner. <laughs> Wait, can you hold this for a second? Right, seriously? Yeah, thank you so much. That is ugly, and no one's gonna buy it. So our next plan of attack is getting a new truck, and our truck's kind of busted. It's yeah, a little bit raggled. Yeah, yeah. It's not. It's not. Enough. It's like not what we need for the road. We need something a little bit bigger for the road. A little more reliable. Functional. What about this bad boy. I check my lipstick. We're supposed to be truck shopping. I know, well, I was checking it out. I get something this yeah. is, though. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> that door. I'm so sorry. It was not attached to the truck. The entire door fell off. There was shattered glass <laughs> everywhere. I almost peed my pants, by the way. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to get us kicked out. <laughs> I didn't think you would not attached. Oh my god. Oh my god. Uh, maybe this is the yeah, not, not the truck for us, <laughs> I think. And then we had to run away. I need the mini bar. This is like, this is not negotiable. I'm gonna need some cocktails. How big is the mini bar gonna be? Like, if we have something this size, it's gonna take up like an entire quarter well, of a van. It's small. We just have to like figure out how to get the refrigerator. We, defi we definitely need a caravan then. Adjustable poles actually back there. Do you see that? Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, we can put a pole in. <laughs> it's I true. We could, we could do a pole that spins. Is that how we're going to make money? From Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> really? Removable pole dancing band. Yeah. <laughs> this is like my dream to travel around the country, like looking for vintage stuff and selling vintage stuff. I just want to try it on. You just want to try it on? All right, yeah. <laughs> Give me my jacket back! Give me my jacket! Portland, Seattle, LA. We gotta stop in San those. Diego! Oh, let's go to Chicago. Can we hit the big city? Chicago, yes. Now they have amazing stores there. And New Orleans. 
Austin. Austin, Texas. You know San Antonio Dallas. is great too. She's obsessed with Boca. Yeah, I'm just telling you. I think she it's wants to play fine. bingo. She's Miami. a closeted bingo lover. Yes, I am. <laughs> and then let's go to the bayou. I would love some gumbo. I love gumbo. The, we have to make a business. This isn't about you seeing oh. the bayou. <laughs> this is about us getting from place well, to place. Well, I'm sure there's some place. Well, I, there's got to be some good No there. alligator hunters are going to be buying thrift store clothing out of our Maybe, you know, I met this guy named Ruben. He wrestles alligators and he lives in the bayou. Maybe he'd like help us find a place. He likes sparkly clothing. No. <laughs> Maybe his wife does. No. He was super nice. No. 